cost, markup, overhead, profit, and selling price. In order to stay in business, companies must make profit on the goods they sell. The difference between the cost of goods and what the goods are sold for is called markup. Included in markup is overhead and profit. The total of all amounts is the selling price. Overhead includes all the costs of operating business. For example, rent, office expenses, electricity, employees' wages, taxes, utilities, etc. Let's look at an example. Adam's Appliance Store buys a refrigerator for $435. The owner decides to sell the refrigerator for one-third more. His markup is 33 and one-third percent. What should the selling price be? We know that the refrigerator cost $435 and that the owner of Adam's store would like to mark it up 33 and one-third percent. A markup means this price is going to increase to you as the consumer. Going to the calculator, we put in the $435 times the 33 percent markup and we find that they're going to mark up the price one hundred forty four dollars and ninety nine cents remember when we talk about money we need to round off that's the increase in price so we have to add the cost of the refrigerator four hundred thirty five dollars to find that our selling price is five hundred seventy nine dollars and ninety nine cents and that's how much they're gonna sell the refrigerator to you for now let's look at this chart and analyze where this money goes the cost of the refrigerator was four hundred thirty five dollars let's say that Adam's store knows they have eighty dollars in overhead because they have to pay electric bills and expenses and things like that. We know that this entire thing here shows us the selling price of $579.99. If I were to subtract these two numbers, I would get our markup. And our markup was $144.99. So if our company needs to spend $80 on overhead, subtracting these two numbers, $144.99 minus the $80 in overhead, we find that the company has an estimated profit of $64.99. So remember, the markup is the overhead and the profit put together and the selling price is the original cost of the store plus all the markup. This is the price you pay as a consumer. Uh, we're at Stokes Hardware. My name is Richard Noski. I'm a store manager. Uh, this is a business that's been in business for about 45 years. I've been employed with them as a store manager for uh, 26 and a half years. Uh, we operate a retail hardware store and uh, sell to the retail public, plus we do commercial sales. Um, we do, uh, do a lot of the purchasing for the store. Uh, we determine what is bought, how much is bought. We determine what the markup is on the products. 50% of what you have to do as far as figuring out what your gross profit is on certain merchandise and how much markup that you need to put on it. Uh, it you know, there's always a, a big aspect of the business is math. Please pause the video now and complete the problems in your workbook. When finished, press play and we'll continue with the next lesson.